Hello everyone, welcome here. Getting started. Myself, Shekhar Metla, and I am the software industry from the past two decades in the various fields of application development, coding, web development, database services, and writing of a database coding. This all. So adding this particular expertise in this course with the help of chart GPT, how you can apply real world skills to use chart GPT and getting make you master in chart GPT. This course is created for you getting started here and welcome here to use this online course to speed up and slow down videos for complete program. Learn at any time from anywhere using internet connected mobile or computer system and make sure to use practical queries by asking ChatGPT to ensure that a really you will get in a such a great information and wonders. How to get and help? Check your knowledge with the documents and ask ChatGPT to instance queries to getting such a information and also follow stack overflow search engine technique where you can get a resolution of a complex queries submit your question and ask qa forum detailed what you have tried with the screenshot of error code we will help you and how to approach the course yes the best way to approach the course is to review videos with your practical hands-on sessions and all the queries what I have explained in the chart GPT, you just ask your way and applying of your knowledge and what the criteria of your query, you just ask chart GPT to you know your information and follow the video step by step process how it is explained for your practice. Review certain information by reading examples, part of video session, pause it and play it wherever it is highly required for your references. Exercise and solution. A simple exercise given to you to a simple query how you are going to asking a chart GPT and how you are getting an information it is a given here and the solution video lecture is also added over here and my sincere request here to follow the video lecture from the as curriculum decide for you and make sure to submit your great review rating by following the video lectures. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome here. Getting started on Windows, Mac and Linux operating systems. This lecture especially designed to choosing an operating system is very essential for beginners who are starting their career. So this course is designed for an operating system. If you are comfortable in Windows 11, Mac or Linux operating system with a web browser of Google or Mac or which you loved one browser. Yes, comfortably this course you can learn using any of the operating system. Basically, ChartGPT is a master open AI tool. You will explore more resolutions, questions, how to use and how to master in ChartGPT. This course is uh, ultimately the information which we'll share with you. I'll see you at the course. Thank you. Hello everyone. Welcome here. How to ask great questions in this particular course journey. So let's see quick help. Your great questions will be answered on Google at try first and also you are learning master in chart GPT AI course to resolve your own questions by asking a query to chart GPT and the second level look at error what information or what you are facing in your learning journey with the practice. And also there is a stackoverflow.com which is the best technical forum where you may find super seniors get their questions answered there about your functionality and complex problem statements. If you are not finding any 
in chat gpt then you may try other technical forums write us yes here using this option you can write us a query and comment with error what you are facing provide with a screenshot of the error we will respond you as soon as possible we receive a query for a resolution with the course concept thank you hello everyone welcome here FAQs for this course. Yes, these questions are very important for everyone. What do I need before learning this course? Yes, a basic computer operating if you know and how to access a web browser with internet connection is sufficient to learn this particular course. Is any source provided for this course? C the source code you will generate using chat gpt so awesomely you will make sure to learn many things any computer requirements for this course yes the computer requirement like a uh, internet active for video lectures and practice chat gpt queries to interact more concisely for developers and uh, creating like a uh, resumes what the requirement of your queries in the real world exercises you will be practice such a scenario you need a computer system which is internet active i'll see you at course thank you Hello everyone welcome here chat gpt basics how to initiate and uh, how to create your account and knowing about to chat gpt similarly what the day to day activities how we can get an information using chat gpt you are going to learning from this section so first lecture it is uh, what it is chat gpt it's a very interesting lecture i am preparing here and let's begin to google and uh, check just simply search with the uh, chat gpt a keyword hit and enter this lecture is especially who are going to be initiating and start learning from scratch we are going to initiating with the help of uh, scratch steps to making an a hero let's begin see very simply i would like to say an important point when you hit chat gpt in google and the first link you may observe here openai.com yes this when you click inter, like a introduction of chat gpt you will be redirected to openai tool of chat gpt yes what is chat gpt can anyone guess it yes chat gpt is an artificial intelligence chatbot developed by open ai yes this open ai group of people are developed and launched in november 2022 it is a built on top of open ai's gpt 3.5 and recently it is launched gpt 4 yes and it's like uh, the families we can say that what are the families it's a large language model and has fine tuned using both of uh, supervised and reinforcement learning technologies and uh, techniques are added in this bot what is the like a uh, help of these uh, supervised and reinforcement and uh, like uh, advantages of this chat bot yes let's see here like uh, in the introduction part here we can observe that we have trained a model called chat gpt this tool name they have given like a chat gpt which is a interacts in a conversational way how the question and answers we can communicate each other if any of the persons two or both are joining together the same way with the chat gpt tool you just ask a question and you will get a proper response immediately see chat gpt answer follow up questions 
admit it, its mistakes, challenges, incorrect permis like uh, permises, and reject inappropriate request even. Yes, sometimes ChatGPT is also denying the like uh, inappropriate request if you are asking any other irrelevant information to the ChatGPT conversational AI. So ChatGPT can generate essays. And ChatGPT also can write code as a developer, as a programmer, or as a freelancer. And also ChatGPT answer your queries. What type of queries it can be answered? Yes, the different people ask their different way. Someone is interested in marketing, someone is interested in modeling, someone is interested in education, someone is interested in real estate finance what the category you want to choose as a career and where you want to build and want to make a master in that particular criteria or or any if you want to make sure to prepare any essays yes and you want plain make sure like uh, any diet plan for you yes chart gpt will arrange and information how to make it and also strongly remember this chat GPT can also this bot also can prepare an images for you how wonder it is so how to make sure to learn these things how to approach chat GPT in more way what we are going to discussing and learning from this chat GPT master classes Yes, can it be charged anything? No, users can still access this chart GPT chart board absolutely free with the help of either Microsoft or Google, any one of the email account. You can register it and avail the services absolutely free. So how to set up an account and how to access chart GPT, we will see in the next lecture. I'll see you there. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome here. This lecture you are going to learn create a chart GPT free account with the help of Microsoft or Google email ID. If you are having this email IDs, you can create freely. If you are not having, yes, even you can create an account absolutely free with any of the email ID, whereas you have to provide a like a simple authentication and uh, authorizing to control your chat GPT account. Let's see by hitting very simply in Google chat GPT and hit enter. Now the first link openai.com here it is uh, showing like uh, introducing chat GPT click here you will be redirected to in this particular openai.com forward slash blog forward slash chat GPT. So introduction part it's uh, completed in earlier lecture. Now try chat GPT a simple link option it is presenting over here. Now we are going to discussing about to creating a simple chat GPT openai free account. So click on try chat GPT. Immediately it will take you like a chart GPT chart.openai.com forward slash auth and means it's nothing but like authentication and login. So here you will find welcome to chart GPT login your open AI account to continue. There is a two options if you are already registered and if you are already familiar to enter inside the chart GPT then you choose for login and hit your credentials of email ID and password. Now, if you are free to like a new to create an account in chat GPT, what you need to do sign up. There is an option called sign up. Yes, create your account. Please note that the phone verification is required. Like uh, your number will be used to verify your identity for security purpose. Yes, it's an, a free account and they are trying to verifying. Yes, it's a genuine and authorized person or not and human or not especially it is identified here so given any email id yes other than if you are using like a google or microsoft account then you can give the other email id if you are having 
Google or Microsoft just directly click this button. See how it is, how it is like continue with Google. Yes, I am registered with the Google. So my Google account is presenting over here. So when I am clicking like what the account I have already signed up, then I have to go over here. That's it. Then immediately it will take you to register yourself or else what you need to do if you are already registered and you are already like uh, having an, a username and password for this particular chat GPT chatbot access of dashboard and access what you need to do already have an account login so this option what it is says welcome back and it's asking like again email ID to continue and I have a registered with the continue with the Google so I asking you to clicking here for Google then I'm selecting my registered email ID so what it is it is an understanding and it is taking to my successfully logged in and here it is a ready to send a message prompt it is a showing like a how we are going to sending like a any phone message or uh, whatsapp message to the uh, like uh, other persons for a conversation the same way chat gpt is ready to like uh, initiated and it's uh, ready to accepting our queries it's a prompt when you asking here send a message if you type something here it will like uh, see i'll show you type here it's uh, here we need to type a, our query what is the needed information we need to type here and uh, submit here in the right side part this is a button we have to send to the chat GPT the chat GPT neural network which is an artificial intelligence chatbot which is understand our query and immediately it will start responding by submitting our query here immediately yes sometimes truly I, I remembered one point sometimes chatbot is a sometimes like a little bit busy due to the huge request and queries to the chatbot so be patient she if you are not getting proper response or any error message in the chatbot take a few minutes and try immediate like a later chat gpt definitely what you are expecting and you need to like uh, modify your query and re again and changing your query and asking to the chatbot chatbot then you will get a proper response see i will test like a see like uh, this is an example explain quantum computing in simple terms if you type this query here yes what is a simple like a quantum computing it will explain you a step by step guide that is a way like examples it is given what are the capabilities it is given the limitations yes chatbot and chat gpt you just try to use for your development or implementation or any new research which is a useful for universe right and i think this lecture will make you master in what you are expecting like a area or career development in your area i hope it's a very super easy lecture next lecture we'll see how to use this chart gpt and i will explain what the dashboard and options which are involved in here i'll see you in the next one thank you Hello everyone welcome here how to use chart GPT yes this lecture is specially designed separately why because the basically once you successfully created an account and uh, logged in using username and password where you have to find here it's in a dashboard view you will see see in the left top the menu it is showing like a new chart yes when you click here the new chart is ready to taking your request or queries chatbot is ready in your computer system yes how to access uh, this uh, live chatbot and uh, accessing the queries yes your computer system to be connected with the internet properly yes when you are trying to accessing the, this chatbot uh, website and creating an account how which is uh, connected with the internet the same way you need to connect to the internet connectivity and uh, try to access this this chat gpt tool ai tool to get a proper query responses immediately let's simply just i'm asking a chat gpt like a very simple question what is the like uh, suggest a baby like uh, suggest means like many names it may it may request 
three baby names starts uh, start with like uh, letter um, something like you know something i would like to give like uh, j first letter i want to be j and uh, the names i am asking to the chat gpt suggesting wow jackson juliet and jackson so how beautifully if you want to five if you want to like uh, 10 names you just ask a chat gpt immediately it is a given a query response over here how beautiful and the similarly you want to make a business tagline or business title or anything see like uh, ice cream shop uh, name simply ice cream shop you want to start suggest a name of suggest ice cream shop name just it like a suggest a name for ice cream shop also you just ask a proper question suggest a name like uh, for an ice cream shop that's it just what i in my mind how the query is uh, preparing just i'm trying to asking chat gpt so how about like a uh, frosty delights simply it is suggesting a name of uh, frosty delights if you want any tagline for this simply tagline for this just ask continuity question you just asking a conversation one question is completed along with that you want to conversation you to add it so just i'm asking tagline for this or for this name you can add it so see indulge and in our frosty delights scoop after scoop how beautifully it is a given for an a simple scoop like uh, how the ice cream shop tagline we need to create it beautifully and if you need any sale plan for this ice creams why don't you ask chat gpt yes you can ask suggest just suggest any any sale plan for this shop so if you want to make sure to digital marketing or you want to make sure to like uh, attract more customers to improvise your business or any financial plan for this ice cream scoop shop you just ask chat gpt a step by step process this step by step process will explain you and guide you make sure to understand you to start your own business your way for an example i am sharing with you this knowledge how to approach if you want to make sure any technology any product development or any software app development website development what is in your mind or any thesis preparation for education for the students any project preparation see how the beautiful steps how you are approaching a step by step any essay you need you just ask it see suggesting a sale plan i just ask a chat gpt on the sale plan for ice cream shop could be loyalty program here is an example offer customers loyalty card any of the card they can scan and stamp every time they purchase a scoop of ice cream after a, uh, like a certain number of scoops offer them a free scoop or a discount on the next purchase how you can attract more you could also offer exclusive deals or flavors for loyalty card holders this incentives customers to keep coming back to your shop can help build a loyal customer base so when how many cards you are offering to the customers such many customers make sure to come back to like a like a grow your sell like a sale automatically and if you need any more plans you just add a query as a add on or as a top up you can add a query to the chat gpt and ask today how super easy you can make it and also you just to try is as a developer you want to make sure to know how to learn python variables let's i'm asking a python programming language will is it uh, suggest to the python is it true wow see learning python language variables are important part of understanding the basics of python programming language 
not only python like a standard understanding of any programming language you should understand very cleanly for like a variables how to declare and what the standardization to write a variables so see start with basics before you can learn about variables it's important to have a basic understand of python syntax data types and operators can find many resources of online teachers and youtube lectures are readily available and many blogs are there open tutorials free to use and access you tr try today and understand what the variables a variable is a container it's a store a piece of information yes it's like a data or value it's like a container can hold the different values it may be value it's may be like a number string or decimal point like amount or prices it may be like a number which is a point is decimal value is there we can call it as a float value or a decimal character yes we can hold it and variable names yes when you are writing like a give a variable name these names used refer to values or stored in the variable where we want to access this variables yes the same name we need to use to convert like a conventionally we can reuse this variables to access this values and practice creating variables yes programming my suggestion always you need to create and write the variables or programming is necessary to practice more and more while creating number of variables while creating different type of data types yes these are the very important experiment with the different types of variables like a try creating variables and store different type of data types list tuples and like a, not only single value multiple values when you are storing and when you are trying to accessing what exactly the required value you want to access from the group of values when it is stored into a single variable then it is a comes under like a multiple variable storage yes this is a very important when you are playing with the code practice yes make sure to practice with the complex programs will help you to making speedy decision and speedy writing of longer programs practice repetition what you learn the same way you have to habitually you need to type keep on typing and learning and writing the code which will eliminate syntax errors writing errors code errors and you will be comfortable with them so try today and this way you can learn like a vast huge programming techniques as a developer if you are seeing in a coding you don't be panic learn from scratch zero to make sure to hero thank you for watching this session thank you hello everyone welcome here chat gpt for day to day activities yes will it be day to day activities also can be resolved using and taking a plan from using chat gpt shall we ask a question to chat gpt and we'll get an information suggest a like a meal with seafood like a, if you want any like a, with the calories or any of a special like a, which is a your requirement you just ask a question to the chat gpt just i am asking in our day or if i want to schedule something yes i can ask to the timelines and all you can ask chat gpt to you will get an information properly so it is suggesting like a simply like a white with a white wine with a sauce it's a something like you know seafood meal i am asking to suggesting no it's a clearly given like some ingredients of uh, seafood and it's a instructions how to prepare and cook so if you are really interested to preparing seafoods and getting and uh, prepared like a gathering of collecting of this like what we can say that ingredients be ready to prepare your own food but the following of the step by steps and ensure just i'm asking suggest a like uh, um, you can uh, like uh, how to prepare you just it's not a suggest it's not required then how to prepare a 
chicken recipe it's like a simply i'm asking chicken recipe simple chicken recipe i'm asking to this particular chat gpt query simply easy to make roasted chicken one whole chicken three to four uh, like uh, lbs the quantity two tablespoon olive oil and uh, uns unsalted butter cloves lemon salt and pepper to taste so here prepared like a uh, preheat your like a oven so the instructions how it is given how simply you can prepare your own chicken what you can say that serve this roasted chicken with your favorite like a uh, side dishes such as roasted vegetables mashed potatoes or like a salad enjoy the salad which is a having you can enjoy it so using chat gpt to get not only the developers task not only in education task but also it can give you an information from your kitchen how to make a beautification of your like a lobby or like a hall how to decorate what it is the requirement of ingredients the things needs ask chat gpt and know about the information and make sure to start preparing one by one i'll see you in the next lecture which is a latest chat gpt what it is what the features are available in this chat gpt plus we are going to see i'll see you there thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to know advanced chat gpt of uh, chat gpt plus which is the version of chat gpt 4 so recently which is uh, updated from open ai tool and you want to like uh, access this chat gpt advanced tool of 4 or plus what you need to do just simply like uh, see here the entry screen of openai.com it is there no so here read about the chat gpt plus so here it is a given a clear instructions about chat gpt plus and the updated information how it is a benefited to the users yes as i told you in the introduction part of chat gpt sometimes chat gpt is in a busy with the network of a huge request and queries which are receiving from the different like uh, universal points now what they are doing we are launching a pilot of subscription plan for chat gpt a conversational ai that can chat with you and answer follow up questions and challenges incorrect assumptions so read about this what it is like let's see this new subscription plan chat gpt plus if you are want to access more accurately and uh, the query response more than others you want to get in a quick response will be available 20 dollars in a month and subscribers will receive a number of benefits what they are what the advantages of uh, chat gpt like a uh, plus 4 or advantages uh, like uh, advanced chat gpt see general access to chat gpt what normal people will access the chat gpt all can be accessed even during peak times yes what is peak time yes many of the persons they may trying to getting in uh, solutions or like a uh, resolutions for the chat gpt sometimes it says that network errors due to network uh, error it is says that something is a uh, getting an error yes chat gpt will tell you very clearly in like a something like a red mark query it will show you yes you have to try after some time even such a time you want to get an immediate response from the chat gpt where you have to go for subscription plan for chat gpt with the month of dollar uh, 20 in a month then faster responses in times priority access to new features and improvements will be given to the who are accept 
and availed subscription plan in ChatGPT4. See, ChatGPT Plus is available to the customers of United States and around the world. We love our free users as well as continue to offer free access. Yes, you want to, like you can access ChatGPT always free at present. And you want to make sure to get more advanced features and more faster ChatGPT. Yes, you can go for subscription plan and helping to the support of free access available to the many people as possible to solve them learning and making them like a master in less time learning from the research preview yes many of the updates and researches what are the use cases of the users like uh, in terms of including drafting editing of content like uh, ideas programming help and learning new topics which are going to be keep on adding this open ai group Yes, our plans of the future. Yes, and refining and expanding offers of the based of based on the feedback what we have they have received from the users who are already accessing. They may be like a putting like a waiting list which is a going to be access of the new futures in uh, earlier. What is the waiting list? Yes, waiting list is nothing but uh, who are obtained early. They can give a priority wise. They can uh, add the business plans and ideas and more updates which they prioritizedly they can give an accessibility of this particular registered waiting list users. So is it uh, improved any chat GPT open AI 4 means yes really it is improved more how it is improved in the sense chat GPT 4 like uh, you know like uh, ensure that uh, it is a uh, giving like a uh, something information more accurately you are getting an answers with your chat GPT advanced and chat GPT 4 if you are having a free time just explore it with this uh, document and uh, help and support definitely you will get an understand how the subscription plan will help you if you are willing to go and uh, uh, having a less time and you need in a such uh, information accurately go for subscription plan thank you Hello everyone, welcome this section. This section you will be learn like a chart GPT for developers who wants to make sure to create their career in vast in software development, especially in the software skills, how you need to make master. Let's see one by one this lecture, especially for chart GPT for programmers who want to make sure to write a coding and uh, improving the coding skills and how to develop their skills in programming. Let's begin with the help of chart GPT. Yes, as I share the knowledge about to chart GPT in our previous section, like a uh, chart GPT is an open AI tool, which is uh, introduced by open AI group, which is a uh, freely available in the industry now. So having a free account, you can simply access this chart GPT with the try chart GPT link. If you are affordable to like uh, ensure by taking a subscription plus or plans yes you can get more advanced features of chart GPT like a performing and peak times response and more accurate result set you will get like uh, what others can take like uh, can get from the subscription plan so let's see how it is a uh, helpful for programmers so chat gpt is a if you know a simple things i'll i would like to share my views here with the programming like especially for a development team as a being in a programmer like you need to learn the skills in any programming language such as c or c plus plus or java c sharp from the microsoft technologies or python which is a recently very vast range of uh, Python programming language, which is uh, expanding in the software era. And also you would be learned like uh, in terms of uh, in the software company, you are making as a DevOps engineer or AWS engineer or cloud environment engineer, how you can cope up your knowledge and build strongly and uh, make sure to making like uh, taking a uh, solutions for troubleshooting how it is possible it's a very easily possible so 
I suggest you as a programmer from the Python programming language and JavaScript how to start learning and how to make sure to strong in this programming languages we will have a simple look here. So first I would like to like uh, see suggest a JavaScript course curriculum. Suggest a JavaScript course curriculum. Yes, Java is a first letter capital and S is a first letter capital. If you placed, then understanding of uh, this uh, like uh, grammatical correction. Now, suggest a JavaScript course curriculum to like uh, learn. Like let's see, just I'm trying to asking ChatGPT to suggest a best curriculum, course curriculum for JavaScript. So any of the student or professional who want to switching or who want to start a career in javascript like why the javascript only see javascript is nowadays it's a really a great trending scripting language yes how like uh, which is a lightweight pages can be developed using javascript and making client side interactions and ensure even low bandwidth of internet you can create wonders using javascript so see suggesting javascript course curriculum for introduction about to javascript and role and responsibilities in web development area and a setting up to write a program and develop and implement of using javascript language it's a scripting language and what the length of the like learning the things in the basically variables data types and operators where you have to start from the beginning so when you start with this culture of uh, like uh, things where you, may, you need to immediately control flow and functions control flow statements is nothing but if else statements switch cases and uh, construction of uh, making of a uh, statement for like a uh, decision making systems and for loop yes for loops for like you know like uh, making a control of uh, environment with the multiple types of data and multiple records and scopes and closures Arrays of objective, creating an arrays and iterating over array. Iterating is nothing but how to access a requirement of array item and how to like use array item and push, pop, shift, unshift, like a splice, concatenation of. These are the built in array methods. How to use and implement and apply array methods and creating and accessing objects, properties, and methods object oriented like a program principles where you have to apply to how to reuse code this you can easily apply in this criteria now dom manipulation events dom is nothing but document object model where selecting elements of the modifying like a modifying of their properties and correction and accessing and reusing this dom objects and also how to handle click events hover effects submit button actions when the user is clicking some button for an action like a save or sale or get these are the types of buttons how to handle and ajax api integration ajax is nothing but a synchronized javascript and xml which will make the request automatically in the low bandwidth and lightweight it won't send all the page request to the server what the part of Ajax is implemented, that particular box or area only submitted to the Ajax component to the server and it will get the fetch the result from the server. Working with the JSON objects. Yes, JSON data and JSON objects, we can, we can call it as the same thing. And consuming data is a third part APIs, application programming interface. An introduction to EC, ES6, this is the latest arrow functions, templates and uh, spread the rest of the operators classes inheritance this will come under under the new latest javascript components asynchronous javascript is like like a how to implement the callback functions promises and asynchronization and await when the person is a clicking and how to wait some time to get in a proper response advanced javascript how to handle errors generate iterators like a modules and javascript framework yes this is like uh, recently react angular and vue these are the most popular javascript frameworks and making trending in software industry in web development area so and uh, along with the these frameworks there is a popular libraries which are ready-made functionality already available javascript and lodash so here 
If you are looking in a future in JavaScript in web development, yes, consider such a curriculum and prepare and learn from what the outcome you will get. And similarly, I just ask a chat GPT to suggest a Python course curriculum to learn like a, this curriculum how to start and learn see if you are interested to machine learning specify the machine learning curriculum and if you are interested to data science you just specify the data science curriculum and also AI artificial intelligence and chatbot and app development what the area and especially using python with the framework of django or flasco if you are interested you just specify you just get what the requirements to need and make sure to like uh, ensuring how to make a master in this particular area see chart gpt is suggesting a vast range of theory and uh, variable data types and basic arithmetic operators logical operators control control flow things of conditional statement loops functions and recursion data structures list tuple sets dictionaries how simply superb file IO, reading input and writing files, file modes and permissions, object oriented programming classes, objects, inheritance, polymorphism and along with the modules and packages, how to create a module, how to get the packages, built in of OS modules, sys, date time, built in modules, error handling and regular expressions of using these things, numpy and pandas, installing and a basic data analysis of numpy and pandas, working with the arrays of data frames, introduction to the Django, creating a Django project, working with the models, views, templates, and a flask, how to create a flask application, working with the roots and templates. So, learning in this way of a complete Python course, how superbly you will get in a job opportunities. How to the programmer can improve the job opportunities? Yes, this, these are the sufficient to learning content we are getting from the chat GPT. Will it be give a complex program statements and coding ready-made functionalities? Will it be? Shall we try a simple like a C, write a like a basic tick tock type tick tack TSC. Toy game, write a basic TikTok toy game. Just I am asking to chat GPT. Oh, just a second. Actually, we have to specify which programming language we need to get it. So, unfortunately, it is a writing in Python, and in my mind also, I am asking to the Python game suggestion. So, Python, if you know how to prepare, write a functions in Python and a print statement, variable declaration, how to access arrays. Definitely, you will be directly take this TikTok toy game and uh, write and run directly in your playground or where your code Python programming language run and see the output in your local development environment. Yes, it's really awesome. So, my sincere suggestion for beginners and professionals who are converting and trying to ensuring to developing uh, start creating your career in a way learn the basics perfectly and understand what chat gpt is written yes this is the variable declaration how it is and how the input is, is taking from the user so it is a if condition statements it is prepared else statement and playground like a play game it's a method or function it is calling like a play game it's a play board and blood it is a creating and a C this is the function it is calling that's it so welcome to TikTok toy game it is a displaying and it's a completely running the game from scratch just need to take a code completely copy code and like a spell like a specify in your computer system or playground paste it and run it that's it straight away this game will function properly in the all the conditions so test today if you want to make a programmer start learning with the chat gpt help you will be like a master if you want to learn basics from like a also chat gpt you can learn or if you want to see the video lectures help or take a help with a YouTube or any other resources which are already available. Thank you.
Hello everyone, welcome here. In this lecture, you would like to know how to improve problem solving skills with the help of ChatGPT. Yes, this OpenAI tool will help you always when you are facing a complex problem in your real life or working environment in application development or any code logic you are implementing. So how we can get first I would like to ask a chart GPT to simply how to like uh, improve problem solving skills. See just I'm asking a query to chart GPT and we will see like a few problems how to solve and how we will get in a solution for it. Let's see particularly like uh, in the software industry to be make like a development or implementing many of the such a real world problems and real world solutions we need to identify as a developer as a programmer what you need to do you will receive a problem statement where you have to find the solution for it to solve and save more time and solve many lives so how it is possible yes this is a possible way where you need to implement in your like a real time functionality or writing a code in a real world application or project development. So improving problem solving skill a combination both practice and learning new techniques. Yes, what the technology which is already there in the existing in the industry and coming the new technology will always help you to making like a mini problem solution will be find at a single place. These tips to improve your problem solving skills and legacy problems will have in a solutions in the new technology. Let's see practice regularly the more problems you solve better you will become it. Practice problems the challenges you push into out of your comfort zone and break the problem down. So it is a very important tip. If a problem seems too complex what you need to do break it down into smaller smaller chunks and how it can manage like a how you can rearrange this problem to manageable part. This will help you focus on each individual part of the problem and solve it and a step by step process you can join them to find a big solution at single place. Analyze the problem. Take the time to understand the problem first. Identify what you are asking to solve, what the query you are listening and what the requirement you are taking and how to solve it. Make sure to understand the detailed constraints before you been solving and use a systematic approach. Yes, it's a suggesting of chart GPT like a use a consistent problem solving strategy or framework to help to solve the problems, some popular approaches including trial and error, working backwards and using visual aids. Learning from the mistakers. Like uh, see, mistakes are natural part of problem solving. So you are trying to doing something but you are thinking what you are expecting outcome if you are not coming then you say that it's a mistake. So you are learning from them and reflecting when you are doing wrong or right. So try always you need to you need not to stop the trying you have to start doing something and collaborate with others yes collaborating with others will help you to solving your problem in less time so more creative solutions they may receive and read watch tutorials yes many like uh, blogs and uh, tutorials online resources available to help you to improve problem solving skills and uh, social media groups or like uh, any of the area which you are working by joining there they can share the knowledge and to reading those uh, problem statements and applying it will be help you. Stay positive. When you are inside the problem solving area it's a challenging task. Important to stay positive and uh, get, uh, you need not to get like, uh, discouraged. Believe in your ability to solve problems and stay motivated to keep improving yourself. Remember, problem solving skills takes time and effort. Don't get discouraged. Don't see immediate result. With the practice and practice, you can become a more effective problem solver. Then you will get huge packages. If you feel, yes, this lecture is helping you to approaching how to approaching a problem solving uh, like a skiller you. You just try any of your problem which you are not solving properly. Try today by asking a query and I just asking 
create a calculator program in python calculator program in python just i'm asking to chat gpt this chat gpt is supporting me to creating a particular function yes completely a like it may be like a small i'm asking basic it's a creating and it's giving to me like a two inputs and a conditional statements it's preparing so if you know the basic how to use this function then immediately you can apply your way and you can like a using and applying your problem solving skills more and more with your queries yes try today and improve your problem skills in any area not only python maybe java or database or devops any of your interesting area try today thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you will be known and uh, how to create an algorithms yes every software industry or every software engineer to understand how the algorithm will function and what is an algorithm these things should be clear and concise where he needs to apply an algorithms to like uh, the same functionality repetitively will help to extend an application or project in enterprise level so let's see first i would like to with the help of chat gpt i'm trying to getting such an information first my question is what is an algorithm a l so let's see yes such as something went wrong for this uh, persistent of uh, contact like uh, through the help center it is asking no try regenerate the response let's wait chat gpt is understanding what it is yeah if it's still persisting the same it is a repeating what you need to do take a query of copy reload chat gpt so sometimes if the chat gpt is receiving huge like a potential of queries yes such time you will get an message so it's a verifying it's a human or like a chatbot just you check the confirmation yes now you just submit your query what is an algorithm see simple terms chat gpt is suggesting for us an algorithm is a set of instructions step by step proceeding to solve a problem or a specific task so systematic approach solving a problem or completing a task can be expressed in a finite number of steps what the steps how to approach how to take in a step by step what step will be resolve the what task it will be clearly specified in algorithm so specifically in uh, algorithms used in various fields such as computer science mathematics engineering terms and many more in computer science algorithm is a sequence of steps rules performing computer solving a problem computer algorithms can be implemented using programming languages to perform variety of tasks such as uh, sorting data searching implementation solving complex problems effectiveness of an algorithm can be measured by efficiency which is an amount of resources required to solve problems such as time and memory design and analysis of algorithm is a very like a key area of computer science as it's a essential creating efficient and effective software programs so just basically we'll see a simple so like a sorting algorithm in python how to implement and how to write if you know the basic things if you know the basic things just i'm asking chat gpt to write a like a sorting algorithm like a, what is the like a algorithm with the sorting for anywhere you may go yeah write a sorting algorithm in the language which language i need to prepare this sorting algorithm also i am suggesting to chat gpt so chat gpt is implementing a def it's a keyword which is implementing like a simple creation of function so function function name and r arr it's nothing but it's a parameter any keyword of name you can specify over there and it's a bubble sort method it is created how super easy and here you can this function by passing the un, like a unsorted array to this particular like a, this is also nothing but test case 
which you can test it like uh, this algorithm in your playground or in your local python code development environment if you are already having take a copy of this code and call this method or function by using this test case so by reading this information also you can what is an algorithm how it is implemented what the things are like uh, applied to getting assorted with the bubble sort you will be learn very clearly a step by step approach and also i ask a chat gpt to write a binary binary search algorithm in python or java which programming language you are interested you just try to ask chat gpt to get such an information so here is an implementation of binary search algorithm see the code chat gpt itself it is creating so how wonder it is so learn the things from the basics from any of the resources and try to apply and learn many logical things with ease by hitting your query i hope this is the binary search algorithm it is implemented and it's a test case is how to access and how to call this method in your local development area wo log n it's an, which is means the efficient algorithm searching large data sets yes any huge data you can give to the this particular algorithm to pumping or passing yes definitely you will find such algorithm to implementing and you will get in a proper requested result with ease such a added advantage by learning and applying your uh, skills in your resume definitely you will get and uh, you will be master in the programming language as well as you will be inside of your job area i hope it will help you a better way to improving your skills thank you Hi everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to know how to build a website using chat gpt support is it possibly create website for my own purpose or any of a business purpose is it possible to create chat gpt with my website yes let's see i just trying to asking chat gpt to create a like a build a basic website will it be possible or not let's see see like uh, really if you know basic html and applying of css or bootstrap frameworks yes it's very super easy with in your hands the power of chat gpt like uh, let's like uh, what my question is create a basic website using html and css let's see just i'm trying to hitting my query to like a chat gpt so what it is creating here it's creating like a example of basic website using html and css html is nothing but hypertext markup language and css is a cascading style sheet which is applying for making a beautification of web pages so html code here it is like a html open tag and head tag it's a title it's my website and home about us and contact it's a the links like a link like a like you know that ul it's in a an ordered list and li is in a list items how the menu items you want to make sure it's a nav tag it's a created for menu items and main yes the content of what the content you want to create you can replace this content and about a section and contact us yes name email message what the send like a sending email form like how to prepare and design everything is designed for us and copyright information is a footer now in addition to save as in a style.css this particular code and make sure to apply into your html page yes your site would be like making more beautification how super easily this index the main page it's nothing but index.html how super easily this complete whole thing see style.css it is given here if you take in a copy of this code absolutely you can use it it's a free to use 
and make sure to specify my website in the sense your company name you can replace it and start exploring by creating wonders in websites and web application developments yes if you know the basic how to what the tags are available in HTML how the CSS is going to be applied to the HTML that's enough see this is the CSS style tags also it's created it's a header tag which is applying for this style to this particular header where it is applied in HTML components so H H1 wherever H1 is used it's a front size is this one margin is this one and now yes UL is a padding and display these are the properties and attributes for CSS components so I hope by creating HTML pages and uh, CSS components and if you want to make sure to apply a card item for this HTML website what you need to do yes bootstrap is having wonderful themes and wonderful ready-made libraries which are developed by CSS so if you want to add such an item in your HTML site see add a card item from bootstrap so what I am giving this website I am trying to asking add a card item add a card item which is developed from bootstrap I have given which is in my mind I have given so see welcome to my website it is given main content only so here it is in a card design so card and a developments which is a like a implementation of card item requirement of title text main basic if you want image add in yes you can put in an image type these all the things you can learn and how the step by step how it is going to be applied in your uh, particular HTML page also it's given and also this particular link item script items to be add to your web page to get and uh, utilize bootstrap uh, like a built-in library functionality in your web page yes is it uh, payable links are free these all are absolutely free you just try to explore more on bootstrap CSS HTML yes you should make wonders if you know how to ask chat GPT yes definitely you will create and build your great responsive websites thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to learn how to develop a stunning landing page for product sale website so any of my products are there how to create and how to sell my product in real world and real market is it possibly create yes with the help of chart GPT it's really possibly and you can make sure so just I'm trying to asking chart GPT to prepare yes as a freelancer you are as a developer you want to make sure to know and create an idea to implement a stunning landing page who are like uh, anyone is uh, opening your website they make sure to they need to stun it so let's see just I'm asking chart GPT like uh, develop a stunning landing page clearly for product sale if you want to make sure any particular product you just also specify the particular product yes it will help you if any such a great information for you yes this stunning landing page product sale using HTML and CSS along with the JavaScript it is creating for us so here HTML page is created head is created within the head product sale landing page very specifically it is created what what you need to do how to use this code yes you need to have in a code editor any of playground or code editor which is a sublime text editor in my view which is a free or any other operating system if you are using other than Windows yes which you are comfortable in your code editor which are like uh, creating web pages or websites there you can take a copy of this code and make sure to prepare index.html opening page paste this code there and practice see the output and do the changes what the type of product you want to make sure to change here you need to change that's it and the menu item it is created home products about and contact us here you know that hashtag it's replaced by with the any of page which you are created 
and here it is in a the, like a guest best deal of the products and uh, featured products how to it should be like product one product two how it could be created one by one and also there is a like a footer products sale copyrights reserved this all the code if you take in a copy and pasting into your page of html just to try to run it yes for this you can simply like uh, make sure to prepare like uh, any of uh, open source playgrounds are also there yes play online playgrounds and uh, open source playgrounds you may have uh, early stage investment of the playgrounds ai playgrounds are there let me check any one of the playground or else if you are having already like a uh, sublime text yes it's in a code editor sublime text if you are having yeah it's a, like a creating stunning images for writing code i want yeah code playground also you can put it so just let me uh, yes just i'm going to creating on desktop index.html let's see index.html i'm just creating a page from chart gpt just i'm taking a copy see here it is in a clipboard is there just i'm taking a copy of this code and here i'm taking a paste save it now this is my page desktop here it is there open with google chrome wow it's a page is created with html like this is the page how it is a why it is showing this page is not attached with like a css see let's see like uh, our chart gpt is a creating like a style.css it is creating and uh, css where it is here it is given like a like a regenerate i'm just requesting this chart gpt if it is not oh wow okay okay yes here it is the links here it is the links all are here uh, we just uh, okay okay it's a earlier develop a stunning sure i can provide like a choosing a color scheme it's a giving like you know step by step process it's giving again so just take a copy of uh, this uh, product sale information uh, just a second yeah this css where we have to find the css for this so i hope uh, like uh, earlier css is there i think uh, i might be it might be like a uh, carry forwarding the previous css only mm, yes let me check this css actually it is taking like previous css one it is created no then what we need to do take a new file uh, save as style.css save it and here just minimize and where the css code which is given by earlier yes this one just take a copy and come back to our area save it just to try just just i'm trying to wow just i just replaced like refreshed by saving see the menu items how it is created how much time hardly it is taken for me and get the best deals and the product images what the references are given by chart gpt where you have to specify a few images and check it clearly so see product one any of the image you have to like jpg or png you just add try to add it definitely you will see the card items and the beautification of your web page so you just try from scratch to request from chart gpt and take a support from chart gpt definitely you will learn wonders take a copy of this css also i'm trying to adding over here just what happens save it and reload our site just i'm trying to reloading okay the classes are which are not matching this uh, like i'm trying to making uh, these are the from not bootstrap site but just i'm trying to adding but you, i won't get so proper way you just take a landing page and uh, freshly you just ask a query and uh, take the step by step and what the component intermediately you require you just ask it and also contact page if you need yes you can ask it map by adding you can ask it this way you can develop a stunning landing page for product sale on all and ensure as a freelancer you can grow your like a uh, revenue potentials from here itself thank you
Hello everyone, welcome here. In this lecture, you will learn how to create a documentation for your projects. Yes, with the help of ChartGPT, is it possibly create a documentation? Yes, just I'm trying to making an abstract for my like a driverless car, which is an AI car Tesla is recently launched and it's a successfully going on. So let's see, I'm just asking like a uh, suggest an abstract for driverless AI car. Driverless AI car. Just I'm taking like a project. Yes. Just what suggest like a chart GPT will suggest us. Let's see. Wow. Abstract is created. So driverless AI car project aims to design and develop autonomous vehicle that can operate on roads without human intervention. See the abstraction how it is created an idea it is implemented for us. So the student or in a professional who wants to make sure to creating their own projects. It may be relevant to AI or it may be relevant to non software or any other technology which you are focusing. How you are going to making your query and asking to ChatGPT to get an information. See, in, a, in a advanced to here, this project involves use of advanced technology such as machine learning, computer vision, sensor of uh, fusion to create smart car that can like uh, perceive its environments to make intelligent decisions based on the data which is receives. The project involves developing robust hardware platform that includes the sensors, cameras and many more. What the project is needed, how the abstraction is going to be created for in a project, it is giving us. So see this driverless AI car project, what the things to be needed to start developing. If you need, you can ask ChatGPT and make sure to prepare your complete project and documentation very clearly and as you know that as a beginner any software product or any software industry which is the needs a product development step-by-step -step process and how to access this user manual a step-by-step -step process very highly required to make sure to prepare a project documentation so all the steps you learn and ask a queries to chat gpt a step-by-step -step what the like uh, you know what the documentation is required essential points you should understand then you take one by one resolve it take a copy of this particular created information and ensure to place your real documentation i hope it will help you greatly to prepare and enabling your ideology thank you Hello everyone, welcome here. In this lecture, you are going to learn code debugging with ChatGPT help. Yes. Is it required a software developer or programmer code debugging techniques? Yes. Highly essential who are entering into developing a new project or new coding or new program apps. So code debugging techniques will help you where the problem is occurring and how to solve these problem statement and uh, how you are going to give a big solution in that particular area. Yes, it's really help you more and more. So let's take like a check with the chart GPT, like a suggest best code debugging in code debugging techniques in just I'm asking like a uh, Python. If you are uh, already inside any C sharp or any other programming language, you just ask to chat GPT to know such a skills. Let's see here. Debugging is an important part of the software development. Chat GPT is also suggesting for us to like a uh, challenging techniques and uh, some challenging times. We need to apply these debugging techniques. So use print statement first thing. 
wherever you want to what statement it is coming with a variable value or any other value you should know as a developer then you can take proper appropriate step to the next and track the variable values how it is a step by step also we can say that intermediary steps inside the code what you are writing and how you are going to be going in the next steps use debugger see python has a built in debugger tool that can help you identify and fix errors in your code debugger allows you to step through a code line by line see state variables each step write unit testing yes unit test cases identify the errors what the code you are written and running in your program this series of tests check output functions methods against the accepts the result by writing unit test cases in your code you will catch errors before they become a problem use ide integrated development environment which is using to develop vast range of scale of applications like pycharm visual studio code like a, which you are comfortable to implement and writing and your ide there is a built in debugging tools that can help you to track down errors in your code ides that allows you to break points and stop and step by step process how to go and uh, like um, like monitoring the values how it is involving in your running area of code program execution check the logs yes every software engineer or who are involving into the code it's a very important to identify the log and uh, taking the decisions to solve the problem statements error handling Yes, Python provides a variety of error handling mechanism such as try accept hand like a um, finally blocks. So that will help you where problem is occurring. It will throw an error. It may be customized or built in. So handling such a understanding such a error messages, you can find where exactly it is a root cause analysis. Review the source code. Sometimes best way to identify the errors in your code. Yes. how you are written and what the steps you require analyzing and identifying logical errors syntax errors and other issues if any causing to stopping your problem statements to running yes identify it very easily with the help of chat gpt also you just to try to submit your query even it is in a complex problem chat gpt will suggest you the best way how to write and implement such a problem statement into making into the small chunks and identifying the problem statements and ensure that making a group of uniting a problem to given a big solution i hope it will help you greatly to understand how you deal with your problem statements thank you hello everyone welcome here in this section you are going to know build and scale your businesses using chat gpt yes this lecture the best business ideas to start begin with chat gpt yes what the business ideas how chat gpt will support us let's see i just ask a query to chat gpt like uh, the best business ideas to start just i am trying to asking with chat gpt what chat gpt will suggest us we'll see here so see here are the some best business ideas to start today and online coaching and consultant so with the rise remote work experience virtual communication online coaching consulting services increasingly popular nowadays as you know that you can offer services your area such as business marketing career coaching personal development or health and wellness any of area you what your expertise that you just try to offer e-commerce store start e-commerce store become easier like uh, some platforms are there shopify woocommerce can sell products variety of niche such as beauty passions home goods handmade electronics mobile phones gadgets laptops anything 
so you just try how you can make e-commerce sales yes that you can start today and social media management many business struggles with uh, managing their social media posting accounts effectively and offering services to like uh, increasing their sale so if you understand and learn these social media operations definitely you can handle it personal training fitness coaching as a people becoming more health conscious and people training fitness coaches are required hugely in the industry in high demand so you can offer services online in person or online yes definitely you will and home cleaning and organization services busy home owners often don't have time to keep their home clean and organized yes you can offer such a services to organize their homes regular basis food truck and a catering business so if you have in a passion of cooking and food yes you can start creating like a business of truck businesses and you can specialize a special like a variety of cuisines and dishes and make a mark of yours pet care services many people are owning their pets and caring them they need a person of uh, to come to home and uh, take care, care of their pets and freelancing writing contents and all yes this talent of writing and creative contenting many of the freelancers are growing their career in this area so using chat gpt also you just collect the high quality content and by making the websites or creating of marketing and any of the trend where you want to prepare your content ask chat gpt to prepare your content event planner yes coordinating strong organization skills start an event planner business that will help you greatly in less time home renovation and remodeling home making the market is a boom there is a grow demand in renovation demanding services and experience construction design can offer these services for home makers so whenever you want to scale your business and whenever as a freelancer you want to start your career using chat gpt also it will support you greatly in all the way so try today chat gpt wherever you are interested and show the potential skills and earning of money but all you strongly remember it it will take some time and how you are putting your efforts continuous be in a positive way and try keep on definitely you will be start earning like a, like a, what you are expecting revenue generations thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to know seo basics for your website many of the people i have gone through they can create a website and they don't know how to promote themselves and how to enable such a keywords to find in google search or people are finding such a services what they are offering yes search engine optimization so this seo techniques how to implement using chat gpt i'm trying to getting such an information query response and how to apply we will try to get from chat gpt and we will try to discuss in this lecture so just i'm trying to asking chat gpt suggest yes he wo like uh, basics or techniques for my website you may specify your website very clearly it's a product or what the keyword you require yes see here are some seo techniques to improve your website visibility and ranking in search engines so search engines are nothing but like a google search engine microsoft bing search engine or many other so here keyword research tool using google keyword planner sme rush to identify relevant keywords to your website content where you want to add and what website content you are already having and page title meta description header body text these are very very essential to identify your market 
product ranking improvements and on page optimization ensure that web, your web page optimized search engines including relevant content meta tags or like a alt tags it's an image tag which is there for alternate tag alt tag which will be called and internal links and a descriptive keyword which titles and meta description h1 h2 h3 structure of content how it is planned accordingly your page rank will be increased mobile optimization make sure your website mobile friendly whenever you are doing something like uh, your page development in a responsive design definitely it will adapt to like a uh, comfortably redesign for specific screen size it may be laptop desktop mobile device wherever you are using your website definitely it will help why google search it is a uh, comfortably mobile friendly it's giving like a uh, ranking factors more link building and building high quality backlinks it's an important of seo technique which is a reaching other websites to traffic transferring to your website and content creation yes high quality information relevant to your product it's added to your keywords to your product page yes regularly update the latest products and regularly update the page content including blog posts or articles videos definitely like a users will like a transforming to your website social media yes using social media to promote your website building your brand share your website content to the social media channels such as uh, facebook linkedin and uh, twitter or any other which you comfortable and having an access definitely these postings are essentially re required regularly website speed make sure your website is load quickly even low bandwidth of uh, area of internet definitely your website should be seen in the fast so that will be give you more ranking factor so optimize your pages images low width or low bandwidth pages you just try to create and definitely by adding scripts plugins reduce it local seo yes if you have a physical location or organ, like optimizing your web page for local seo including your location website content adding your business local directory listings yes that will be help you remember seo ongoing process it's a one time it's not a one time job it's a continuous process where you have to update your page or website then you will see the result stay up to date with the latest content of seo best practices make changes of your website needed to improve your visibility and ranking yes definitely automatically it will improve your product sale or your services which will be visible to the many people who are trying to accessing such a services in the world yes definitely you will be grow in your business so try to apply this seo basics if you are a developer or if you are a business owner you need to implement such a step by step process of seo yes you will see a keep on like a growth of your market thank you Hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you will be learn how to make an online course using chat gpt is it really easy yes if you are very much interested to start scaling your skills to making online courses and spreading and submitting online portals to making like a online like a premium course yes definitely you will create easily using chat gpt so my suggestion is what you need to make and ensure all you need to put a quality of content will pace you definitely the quality of the content and the subject expert who are going to be sharing your knowledge in a particular real world skills you need to add in terms of software industry programs other than software industry yes you share your great points to the users what they need to what they have uh, to concentrate and learn from this course definitely pace you so let's see a simple example i'll show you 
just like uh, like uh, I just asking a chat GPT to uh, like uh, communication skills course curriculum idea just I am trying to asking suggest like uh, if I want to prepare a communication skill course in online just I don't know an idea how to approach and how to start how to prepare a curriculum just I'm trying to asking see first thing you should understand the curriculum is very very important for your like uh, online course the structure how you are preparing what the concepts you are adding to like a section and lectures it's a highly important by seeing that sections and the lectures user will go through and take in a decision and how you are going to making a free demos to attracting more users so introduction lecture to be perfectly you need to prepare and don't be think it if introduction is good then other lectures are not good it's okay it will be no don't go that way so user is taken a course and he needs to suggest more people and he needs to submit a social media yes it's a really interesting course that way you can make sure to increase more sale potential so let's see i'm asking chat gpt this communication skill like a skill course curriculum reference it's giving really interesting key areas introduction to communication skills model covers the basics of communication including definition components importance verbal communication written communication interpersonal communication intellectual communication personal communication team communication crisis media business so how these 10 points are given greatly and every you may like a think that it like a, for example interpersonal communication skills is in a section you can add the module covers the interpersonal communication skills such as a conflict resolution and a negotiation and empathy so three independent lectures by adding an introduction of this section you can make it four lectures so in that way you can prepare a clean curriculum and be ready to record with uh, any ppt slides or if you wish to visible any good camera quality of camera and uh, hd resolutions see the quality how it will comes and uh, make sure to plan for a good mic to record no avoid such a strips and uh, no lagging and no disrupts noise no so by preparing in that way of good quality of course definitely it will pay you repeatedly many of the online platforms are available nowadays in the industry of era yes you can submit over there or else you can prepare your own platform to and a landing page to sell your course to your audience why don't you try today not only communication skills at any area you can prepare your online course and sell today it's a continuous process it will be yes add-on tools are there and add-on like upgrading skills are available in upcoming days yes that way you just try keep on continuous process definitely you will reach your way thank you hello everyone welcome here yes in this lecture you are going to know selling competitive products with the help of chart gpt to expanding and scaling your business yes the competitive product you need to be concentrate and sell in a way so a step by step go like a guide process just i'm trying to requesting with the chart gpt how it is suggest we'll see just i'm asking how to sell a competitive yeah p g t i t i v g competitive products just i'm asking chat gpt this request see a few step by step guide it will suggest us so let's see what the steps it's giving us so selling competitive product be challenging task really but however 
These tips can help us. So know your product and make sure to have a deep understanding about the product features and benefits. Understand what sets the apart from the competition able to like uh, articulate this uh, clarity of potential customers. Know your competition. Understand your competitors product, how they are compared to your own. Identify their strengths, weakness, use them information of position like uh, your product is better than alternative. So target the right audience. It's a very important for any business. Identify your target market, understand their needs of present uh, like uh, preferences. Tailor your messaging and uh, marketing efforts of uh, resonate with its audience. Offer value added services. Provide additional services or support or any other in like uh, more discounts to the product that could be make sure like a uh, installation, training, extending warranties or any other or product more one, buy one get one this such a offers. So price competitively. So your offer product competitive price of the point attracting to more customers still maintaining profitability. So leverage of marketing channels, use variety of marketing channels to reach potential customers including social media, email marketing, online advertising and content marketing. So differentiate of uh, branding, creating a strong brand identity of differentiate of your product through branding. This can help you stand out from the competitors, uh, build a customer's loyalty. So once you get in a good brand as a yes, a standard brand of uh, any of uh, branding awareness of your organization or your area, definitely your product goes and pays you more. Remember, it's uh, just about to having a great product, but uh, also about how like a position and market by understanding your product competition targeting right audience offer value added services pricing competition leveraging marketing channels and differentiating of branding you can effectively sell the competitive products in this other competitors if you feel this video lecture is uh, helping you try to Ask ChatGPT if you are having any of the questions more to stand up your build and scale your businesses. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome here. It's an exercise for you to practice just launch your chart GPT and ask a query how to improve sales that's it by submitting this what you are expecting and uh, by adding more for a such a product if you want to make a uh, mobile sales or laptop sales or any other product sales if you want you just ask a query and uh, see the output how you are receiving this is about to do exercise here We'll catch you in the next lecture with a solution. Thank you. Hello everyone. Welcome back. Solution for your query. So here, how to improve sales is a query. This time I'm submitting to my chart GPT and uh, let's see the weighting of uh, chart GPT response. So improving sales can be complex process. Here is a few tips. It's a suggesting know your customer, impo like a improve your product, like a continuously improving the product service or uh, quality and uh, train your sales team a proper way. If you are uh, trying to making a train, well trained people equipped with the sales product effectively. Yes. And uh, develop sales strategy, leverage technologies and use technology to automate your sales process track customer behavior and uh, optimize your sale funnels and offer promotions many discounts and offering buy one get one such a like where the apply applicable things you need to do in a bulk purchases loyalty programs free trials build a relationship with the focus of building and strong relationship of your customer provide exceptional customer services to the users analyze your idea track your sales of data where it is going on regularly identify trends what the trends are going to be improving in the industry that you need to in like uh, integrate to your 
business area and ensure to see for your business growth this is these are the steps or basic ideology what it is going to be chat gpt is also sharing ensure if you are having any personal idea to improving more yes why don't you apply thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to learn like a chat gpt for students support yes this section all the lectures will cover one by one for here particularly how to prepare your resume so not only student for professional also need in a resumes no so the template ideology chat gpt will create for you is it possible let's see i am just asking chat gpt to prepare a resume for fresher so let's see like uh, prepare a resume for fresher for it job or software job so any of uh, category of field if you specified more understandingly it will give you a clean template for you so see just i am giving like a software job suggesting suggestions i am asking from chat gpt it's like your name you taken this template to your word document or any other text document you comfortable so there you just replace with your name address state and uh, email id and the objective it is written so obtain software development position dynamic organization where i can utilize my programming skills to contribute the success of the company yes and education engineering computer science university and the graduation year where it is completed and relevant course work data structures or algorithms object oriented programming database management systems web development what you did it if you are already did for some java or python also you can specify more relevant skills over here and the skills proficient in programming language such as python java or c++ and experience mysql django git github and problem solving skills strong excellent communication skills with the, along with the team words so skills once it is done you will be seen in the projects and experience yes if any intern work you have done yes the company and project if you are free work or any other own projects if you are there you just try to add in experience area if you are done any professional certifications like a oracle certified associate of java or python or any other you just specify on references if any you just add over here if not you just remove the references particular area so this will be strong resume for software job and remember tailor your resume or specific task and applying and highlighting the relevant skills and experience you need to do this particular template modification and you also you can ask chat gpt to prepare a resume for one year experience of devops or one year experience for java one year experience for python you just ask chat gpt today to get your instant resume very quickly and do the modifications and apply your beautifications and get job search quickly thank you Hi everyone welcome here in this lecture basically we are trying to focusing interview preparation with the help of chat gpt how to prepare an interview yes in interview many of the skills you need to focus in terms of uh, communication in terms of uh, like a uh, strong potential on focusing of any area it may be programming or it may be testing or it may be web development ui ux development other than software marketing sales anywhere wherever you are interested you have to concentrate for an example just i am trying to chat gpt just in a question to how to prepare an interview straight away i am asking how to prepare an inter view as a fresher 
just see uh, like uh, what chat gpt we suggest for us see preparing an interview fresher can have a nerve like uh, what the tips it is uh, more required see confident is a uh, preparation is required research the company what company you are going to apply and uh, what will help you to asking the question and uh, position you are applying and review the job description yes what job you are going to be applying what criteria you need to require to see the requirement uh, answers you have to be prepared well and practice your responses practice see the answering of common interview questions such as tell me about yourself so tell me about yourself you have to prepare very well why do you want to work for us and what the strengths and weakness for us specific examples very stories demonstrate you skills and experience how you are going to be expressing yourself dress professionally yes dress appropriately for an interview this shows how take you the interview seriously and committed to work with a good impression bring copies of your resume and bring multiple copies of your resume at any other document of interview may require to ask be on time yes at least reach 10 15 minutes before schedule time that shows you the responsibility and respect of interviewer's time confident yes speak clearly confidently during the interview and uh, show the enthusiasm strongly be polite everyone you meet including receptionist staff members or any other ask a question prepare questions and ask the interviewer about the company and the position shows that you are interested in the company and at last you may ask about your interview and about to do how my interview if you need any corrections yes you can apply to like a uh, change and the corrections you may apply and attend for next interview this is the continuous process you need to learn to gain good points and interview to be impress wish you all the best and also if you need any interview questions for a specific topic maybe interview questions and answers for python freshers let's i'm asking oh sorry it's a wrongly it is given like a p it's a freshers it's a chat gpt is corrected so what is python what are the key features in python advantages modules in python what is a pp so basic questions it's coming and if you know the question and answers from here itself if you already known it's well and good if you are any clarity or uh, clarification is required for any one of the interview question and answer you just ask a chat gpt to know clearly and say the confident answers not only python or any web development or any other criteria of programming or any other other than software industry jobs non code jobs or database or non technical or technical voice process ask a query to chat gpt and know and understand the interview preparation questions and be a strong potential and make sure to create your path in success way thank you Hello everyone welcome here in this lecture i would like to ask chat gpt to prepare a powerpoint content for product sale is it possibly create uh, this such type of content to our powerpoint presentation let's ask chat gpt what the questions it will suggest us just i'm asking chat gpt that uh, prepare a sale content for powerpoint presentation yes powerpoint capital p it will ask so i just uh, correct it yes see you know microsoft powerpoint presentation slides are very popular to presenting any of the product or any of the like uh, educational presentation or product presentations in the business areas so here it's a clearly defining slide one introduction company name and logo presenter's name and title it's showing that so by taking this idea 
you just easily prepare number of slides it's a suggesting almost like a nine slides it is suggesting and every slide what the information and content to be there in a order to prepare in that way rich professional presentations and slides in your own see problem statement identify common problem paint that your target audience and experience show how the problem affect their daily lives why it's need to be addressed and solution present it your product service as a solution in the problem highlight the benefits features what the product you are having and how it is overcome to solving and addresses the problem and testimonials and uh, competitive advantages pricing and packages call to an action what like a sign up today or get started now this actions are take now buy now to offer call to actions and contact information who is the responsible like including like a phone number email website how they persons needs to approach if they are having any questions or concern conclusion thank you for audience time for attention and relevant to the benefit of the product of services courage them to take an action so remember eye catching graphics design elements deep your audience is engaging throughout the presentation good luck for your sales presentation so how super easily the overall idea how it is implement to creating chat gpt the content so ensure what type of presentation if you are maybe like required for presentation for your academic project ask chat gpt what type of slide how many slides and what the information to be added over there you just ask chat gpt ensure that prepare a stunning powerpoint presentations wish you good luck Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome here. In this lecture, you are going to learn innovative job searching techniques using ChatGPT. Really? Yes. See, just i'm trying to asking this chat gpt to suggest some ways where we can find python fresher jobs in usa let's see i'm just asking chat gpt suggest some ways to you can find python or data science so specifically if you specify a location what chat gpt will support us let's see some ways to find data science fresher jobs in usa see job boards there are many online boards of the specialization data science and analytical roles indeed glassdoor linkedin simply hired you can use a filter and narrow down to entry level positions and company websites many companies hire data scientist post like a job openings into link into their careers or job sections of the company website so networking attend data science and analytical events meetups and conferences in your area network with other professionals field ask for recommendations for the entry level positions internships look for data science internships as they can offer lead full time job offers check with your schools careers and uh, set like a center for opportunities or search online internship programs which are available career fairs attend job fairs like uh, that area focus on data science analyticals these events can be great way to meet with the recruiters learn about entry level job opportunities reference ask friends to like a uh, work their uh, local office job development if any relevant to the field of data science or entry level job openings referrals can be powerful tool to find these jobs social media follow data science or analytical professionals or company social media platforms such as linkedin twitter facebook they post job openings these platforms continuously if any openings so just try to follow such a step by step 
and also your resume cover letter job applications hire with skills of experience which you are added and keep on learn the updated learning skills and add in your resume yes definitely you will be inside by job like involving and make sure to get a job very quickly i wish you good luck thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture i would like to suggest you will chat gpt will create a story or novel or any short film story is it really true yes chat gpt also create novels stories for you just i am trying to asking chat gpt for write a short film like a which to be like required like a creative fiction or screenplay if any requirements yes you can add it yes write a short film like uh, what i want to add like uh, for a creative fiction i am asking for chat gpt just see yeah like uh, we can also ask like uh, a story yes let's see like uh, the last key it is asking fade in ext abandoned house day we seen a round down and a complete story it is creating where you can observe here a story the characters what they are asking what they are responding the story one by one it is creating completely so the fiction story i just request to the comedy like a uh, chat gpt then it is preparing for us it's continuous process and if you need some smile or you need like uh, any birthday event or any of uh, your uh, something to be smile to your boss or making a uh, some comedy is it possible see create a comedy for my birthday party or my boss birthday party party anything so let's see party hall day we see a birthday party the fill of a swing of people and all day it's a to sir jessica happy birthday i have a deliver for you jessica saying that smile thank you the cake like a, this is a short film story it is creating how super easily chat gpt is supporting like a friends like a friends to friends three it's a like a teasing and a laughing all singing see once you prepared a step by step process of how if you are interested to making a short films taken a help of chat gpt definitely it will help you and a making a screenplay step by step process also who is the characters what the dialogues there and what the dialogues if you any and if you any suggestions of short film movie titles it will help you hope it will help you for making in if any you are in the um, like uh, ideology of uh, making creative fail try chat gpt today thank you hello everyone welcome here the power of chat gpt i would like to share you in this section so here ensure that this lecture specifically you will be concentrate and focus chat gpt also suggest a best diet plan for a day if you specified age group and gender yes definitely it will give you what the diet plan is good for you yes let's ask chat gpt a common message i am asking like a make a best diet plan for a day just i am asking a simple for universal standard make a best diet plan for a day what like uh, how the chat gpt is suggest for me let's see here is a simple diet plan for that includes a variety of nutrition of food 
Breakfast: two scraps of eggs, one slice whole grain toast, small avocado sliced, and one cup of fresh berries, and one cup of black coffee herbal tea. This is the what it's the breakfast and mid morning snack: one small apple, one tablespoon of almond butter, and lunch: grilled chicken breast, four to six curl like a ounce. One cup of mixed green salad. It is suggesting tomato, cucumber, and all. One small potato baked and roasted. One cup of unsweetened green tea. And afternoon snack is one cup of baby carrot. One by four cup of hummus. And dinner grilled salmon flatty and one cup of uh, steamed roasted vegetables. It may be any one of. And a cup of brown rice. One by two of. and one small glass red wine it's an optional who wants to take that and dessert one small piece of dark chocolate 70% coca or higher see it's a just an example should not be considered as a one size fits all plan it's an important consult a healthcare professional registered dietitian develop a personalized diet plan meets your specific needs and goal yes definitely you are not having any other side effects then you just apply and follow chat gpt or else you want to make sure to confirm this diet plan yes consult your diet who are suggesting for a best plan for you and follow as your requirement and needs so how the power it is there to creating your diet plan of chat gpt i really wonder and apply in your day to day or regular routine queries if any and get more suggested information from chat gpt to enable your ideology to make sure to understand what the things it is better for you thank you Hello everyone welcome here yes in this lecture i'm just trying to asking chat gpt to like a meal plan with a seafood special as an special ingredient is it possibly it will create in a meal plan for me let's ask chat gpt how it is going to be suggest suggest a seafood as a just i request like uh, i'm much interested in seafood as a special ingredient in my meal so it just i'm submitted here yes it's a planning a clearly breakfast fresh fruit salad and glass of orange juice it's a like a even you know and you observe as a to control your diet and uh, adding by your requirement how you are asking your query to chat gpt the power it will shows the neural network it will understand the requirement of the keywords what are in your query accordingly it is getting an information and it is constructing your plan so breakfast it done and grilled shrimps with the salad mixed greens character of tomatoes and and uh, lemon white like a uh, whole grain bread and crackers and see it's an iced tea after snacks like uh, the things avocado cucumber what it is needed and a dinner baked salmon tomatoes which is a, such as a, which you are interested you can add it and glass of white wine if it is uh, optional or lemon juice it's a completely providing like a a day plan for your seafood as an ingredient instead of seafood if you want to like a chicken or mutton or eggs you add it and try to ask chat gpt which is a completely acquire some calories how it is a good for your health it will prepare for you and also ensure that it's an example consider and make sure to always be consult your registered dietitian or healthcare professional to completely develop your plan confirmation and follow if you are having any side effects or any other
विश यू गुड लक थैंक यू Hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to learn the power how we are we can utilize chat gpt powers so by writing a business email for a franchise request how to ensure to make sure like uh, the points to be added in this email and pricing and how to get in a chance of this business franchise let's see i just try to request this template with the help of chat gpt i'm trying to getting like uh, i'm asking chat gpt write a business email for franchise request let's see is it possibly it will create a email template yes see the franchise request it's a creating like a dear franchise offers who are the franchise is offering the person's name it is requesting and here i am writing my expressing my interest of the possibility being franchise your successful reputable business having researched your brand and product services believe that the company's mission values align my own personal and professional goal so to getting a way of the formula of writing and information which is needed to get in a professional way how super easily we can prepare not only this business email not only this e business email and also you can prepare any of official email or any of legal documents if you need yes you can create it and uh, particularly impressed and greatly appreciate the opportunity discussed of the possibilities become franchise and thank you considering my request i look forward hearing from you sincerely nay so this information if you added and wherever it is required to change a highlight of a specific aspects of franchise business means what the highlights you require to get and in touch of creating a franchise business with a partnership so ensure to making such a great business emails or letter or letter formats yes you used to create and make to send in a way of officiality i hope it will help you to greatly expand your business and communication making strongly with the help of chat gpt thank you Hello everyone welcome here yes here you will be known how to get legal documents with the help of chat gpt is it possible really legal documents also can be possibly we can get using chat gpt let's see just i'm trying to asking my chat gpt to prepare a legal document of sale deed format so write a sale deed for my plot sale so let's see just i am trying to requesting chat gpt is it prepared for the legal document yes sale deed the sale deed made date and month year what the year we require to add we need to replace with this text and seller's name and son of daughter of father's name residing at the format and one part and the buyer's part see whereas and whereas like a the sale deed witness as follows what the standardization of information which will goes in indian format it's an amount in words rs indicates it's a indian format sale deed how the legal document is acceptable so all the points necessary points wherever it is applicable in our indian law this sale deed is preparing by chat gpt so if you need if you need more other than sale deed what the other than sale deed yes it's a rental deed if you need or any other legal aspect of legal document which is required for you to prepare yes 
you can create a number of legal documents in the Indian constituency. So accordingly, if you need a sale deed of India or if you need a country specific also, you can specify in a particular chart GPT. Yes, definitely you will get a standardization legal aspect of the formats. Why don't you try today to get more legal documents from chart GPT support all the formats wherever it is required. Witness one means what the name of the person where it is address occupation and the second witness name and the address occupation. This you have to fill the manual data. That's it. Super easily you can create legal documents from chart GPT. I hope it will help you greatly. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome here. This section is specially designed for chart GPT for Excel professionals. How to use chart GPT in your Excel office works. So a very super easy techniques. If you know how to ask chart GPT, then you will get a solution for your Excel. Is it possible? Yes, I'm sure it is possible. See here like uh, expressing of some with chart GPT I'm going to explaining in this video. So Excel we can we can easily identify these are airface total and food car shop these are the items are their budget and here the total of amount it is here. Now you know that from here to here if you select and go for here like a sum alt plus equal to is in a shortcut or by clicking this option you will get in a total of this marks perfect. And also if you've written like equal to sum of B2 to B7 like it's an empty B6 or B7 if you've written the formula which is a here the formula then automatically you will get a sum of the total of this particular information. If it is a huge data and you know the starting point and ending point of the cells and how chart GPT is helping you to create a formula for you. Really we'll see. I am deleting here that uh, this particular information. See, I am I'm just asking chart GPT to write a formula in Excel that sum the values in column B2. See from here you can see it's a B2 and like a 2 B6 like a B column 6th. This is the cell position. It's in a B6. We have to identify cell position in that way. And getting use sum function. I am writing a sum query to this particular just take a copy of this text this query to chart GPT I'm trying to ask him what help chart GPT will do for us just I'm submitting and hitting this query wow to sum the values of B2 to B6 use the sum function in Excel following these steps see click on empty cell anywhere actually the result where you want to present there we can use the cell selection and type the following formula equal to sum equal to b2 to like a b2 colon b6 where how we can implement a formula in excel chart gpt is suggesting us and written for us and given for us so press the enter and all the intermediary steps also it is given for us so press the enter to return calculate the sum. The result will be displayed in the cell you selected in the step one. What the cell you are selected in the step one, it will. See, note some function Excel adds upon range of cells specified by the range references with the para parenthesis. In this case, range reference B2 to B6, which represent like a B2, B3, B4, B6 and B6. So this way cell like uh, the formula is also explained. So I am I'm trying to getting here is the result. So what I am trying to doing selecting the cell in the formula bar I am pasting the formula which is suggested by chart GPT. So if by hitting then enter see automatically we are getting a total. And if you want in this selection area like here if you want get yes you can just paste the so like a formula which we have taken from chart GPT you can paste it. Wow. So how beautifully chart GPT is creating a formulas for us using in Excel office productivity make sure to making automation with the help of AI tool. I hope this lecture will help you to how you can implement Excel more functionality with the help of chart GPT. If you don't know anything yes be ready and try to 
practice like a basic steps then implement how to write a query then you will get a proper result in this area i hope it will help you to save more time in your uh, real time functionality and uh, i wish you good luck by practice more and more thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to learn we look up formula in excel spreadsheet with the help of chat gpt yes it's really possibly you can create if you don't know formula how to write and if you know how to ask a query to chat gpt chat gpt will prepare a formula for you and give you a step by step process where to apply and how to use this vlookup formula to get a proper requested result in excel yes when you are having a large scale of data sets then you just try to use such type of vlookup formula and uh, get immediate result without wasting of any time you just get an immediate result see basically vlookup formula like uh, this is the data it is here and from this data if we want to get something you know like a uh, airface what is the fare and uh, hotel what is the fare car what is the fare if you want shortcutly immediately you just type here s h o p something shop so shop when i type some shop value is a like a reflecting automatically here in the same case if i type like a car what is the car value it's a 180 let's see 180 automatically it is a coming like a budgeting of the car so how it is getting yes by applied we look up such a formula we are able to getting in this such a result so with the help of chat gpt how to we can how we can prepare such a formula see i am implementing write a formula in the excel that search for the values in a8 so a8 here what the value i am typing here in the columns a22 b6 this reference to a22 b6 data to be find then result column to be b use we look up formula that information i am just trying to typing in my chat gpt query so will i get a formula here really i am giving a text and uh, will i get a like a result set of uh, we look up formula just i am submitting this query to chat gpt just wait and see how like a chat gpt is going to be supporting for us yes searching the value a8 and a22 to b6 is the written corresponding values in the b like a uh, using b value as a return so click on the empty cell see wow it's a done for formula creation it's a done for formula creation type the formula of the formula bar selecting of the cell wherever we require to uh, representing this formula we need to take a copy and press the uh, like a uh, select the cell there we have to formula bar we have to paste this and uh, we have to see the result and uh, changing the names so we can see let just let, let's check it see here i want to get the result so i am in the formula bar i am just pasting my values wow if i am changing hotel let's see h o t e l wow 545 what awesomely what awesomely i am getting a result quickly and am i prepared this particular am i prepared any like like a, either equal to we look up anything i am written no not at all why i am prepared a query write a formula in excel such as the values in the a8 what is the a8 value and written the a22 to b6 uh, values what it is there and b column to be written in a we look up function functionality i have written clearly formula is prepared by chat gpt so ensure that make sure to prepare your query in a way how to get yes then your formula will be prepared by chat gpt simply take a formula and apply in your excel spreadsheet this will take you more time it will save and huge data when you are following and applying of many of the complicated formulas you just try to add on in the query what you are asking to the chat gpt you just try to add on yes definitely you will see the wonders and also note we look up function excel looks like a specific value left most column like rules what the rules we have to apply these things are going to be here it is going to be presenting 
strongly remember and apply exploring more on excel spreadsheet thank you hello everyone welcome here in this section you will learn how to generate incredible graphic art with dal e2 yes it's a super easy you can greet like a greatly create your pictures and images and graphic so this particular lecture i would like to introduction about to how to approach and how to access dal e2 services from chat gpt product let's go to google very simply just uh, hit very particularly google chat gpt and hit enter so introduction of uh, chat gpt link here it will be displayed now here what you need to approach for accessing of dal e2 here in the products click on products yes and yes dal e2 click the link wow so dal e2 is an ai system that can create realistic images and art from description in natural language so any query you may ask to the text i want a horse in a garden if you can ask it will create in a horse image for you and it will give you as an image really is it possible this artificial intelligence system will produce an image for you why don't you try today yes next lecture we'll see how to create a 3d image graphic design yes for that how to access try dal e yeah labs.openai.com and here for to access this particular dal e you need to enable your account if you are already registered with the chat gpt using that email access of authorized dal e to access this environment then you can access like a 15 free credits will be there for you to access this particular dal e yes and now see here it will ask like a, an ai impression or a painting of a sunflowers in a purple verse it's asking if you are or else what you need to do something if you want to create an image you scroll down all the images if you write something a photo of a write uh, something whatever it monster standing in a purple room if you want or uh, any green color room with a monster you want to stand you want to create yes you can ask a chat gpt to do a query of your requirement it will create an image for you yes and uh, see for this what is the message 3d render of a cute topical tropical fish in aquarium on a dark blue background of digital art it is created and you want to make sure to prepare like uh, any of uh, like you know uh, what we can say that oil paints computers and uh, let's just see any toy or rob robot you will require a cartoon of monkey in a space a cartoon of monkey yes in the next lecture i'll show you how to ask a query and how to write such a particular uh, like uh, this images and graphics see here you need to type something here a query and a generate that's it then immediately i'll show you in the next lecture thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you will learn like a dal e2 creating 3d graphic design how super easy by texting by providing a texting of requirement will it be created by a graphic design yes i would like to show you a surprise me see start with a detailed description surprise me if you click that you will get really surprised with the an image or you just ask a monkey in a space with a hello background just i am try like what is the in my mind i just asking 
with a phrase of keyword a monkey in a space with yellow background just i'm trying to asking in my mind what it is a query just to generate i just hit here like uh, see it's a scroll it is a loading it's a scroll is loading and it is trying to creating an image wow i'm not uploaded anywhere and i'm not getting from anywhere so one two three four different variations images are created for myself so like see if you want dots you can if you don't want you can click here so see this is an image how super easily i'm getting if i want this download and here just simply dolly image is downloaded awesomely go for downloads just check here see it's a local image this image is created by doll e for myself if you need like a some other background of blue color or yellow color or any other color you like you just try to make a more graphics and edit if you need an edit what is the edit is requirement here you can edit and apply any of see i'm changing like erasing my colors and i'm making a move moving into the some other places wherever you want all the things you can do it really awesome no just try today what the image you need you just try and apply your way i hope you will enjoy such a creating great of uh, like uh, such a images and graphics and oil born paints whatever it you want if you need any sale promotions you just try to ask along with the product you just specify the product definitely it will give you and this all are there is a no copyrights you can absolutely use for your purpose i hope you enjoyed this lecture more i'll catch you in the next one thank you hello everyone welcome here in this lecture you are going to learn doll e2 deep dive in editing your own images yes is it possibly edit or adding any of your custom requirement to the this particular images yes really it is possible so what i am trying to doing here just i am trying to downloading an uh, apple an apple from web so here you can get to use this uh, such type of uh, like uh, uh, what you want to get see creative commons license means absolutely free to use such a apple you just get from web so i'm getting free apple from save image as and uh, go for desktop and save so this image is going to be here wow perfect this image i'm going to adding this particular our dolly site now upload where the desktop and image see it's my custom image i'm trying to implementing this custom image see skip cropping and uh, if you need any cropping uh, you can crop it or else you can skip it done it's done what is the edit it is required for yours what is the edit is required for yours now what you need to do here just my requirement of editing of this image let's see yeah so here like a uh, editing something like uh, a frame to be added or like a uh, like a uh, changes any description of a uh, thing to be added yes i want to simply like uh, add sunflower to uh, sunflower in uh, like uh, yellow color add sunflower to yellow color i am requesting to this particular image let's see to generate i am asking to chat gpt doll e services this ai will recognize and how the sunflower to be in which color you want it may be yellow or it may be red or it may be green whatever it so it will be like you know see it's a different different variations see the yellow color here in the right side you may observe and uh, see three or four variations it will give it to you to adding your image so in the left frame i'm just identifying here it is a good to right side it's showing in a yellow like a 
this particular sunflower it is adding the similarly if you want to make sure to add more things you just try to ask like your chart gpt and this 3d graphic deeply you can drive to edit or clean it or making a color change or whatever it you want in my mind the option to be present and provide you to the facility deep dive is available in dali to be present so i'm trying to adding the sunflower to this particular image which is downloaded from web in my personal local image so is it done the future the option is available it is generated dolgies open ai services so hope you enjoy this letter and make sure to prepare and uh, go with many of your images yes it's saying that 15 credits maybe in subscription plan if you are uh, enrolled yes definitely it may be a limit there is a limitless hopefully or else there is a huge request to be possibly change your and update your own images using dolgy services i hope you enjoy this lecture we'll catch you in the next one thank you hello everyone welcome here how to make money with dal e2 services yes using this ai services to prepare a vast number of images create a custom image as you are required so for an example to making like a promotions as a freelancer like a accessing of dal e services here you can add something you know create a sell port like a poster for like a medical product just i am asking chat gpt to a particular requirement sell poster requirement where it can be possibly it will create for us let's see it's a like a, trying to making a poster for us wow really stunning images it's created awesomely you are observing in my screen like a uh, see like uh, something like a text it is given if you want to you can make it uh, like a edit options are there where you can proceed to edit and a text and write something and uh, where these posters can be offered like uh, any medical name or any titles if you are specified in your title when you are going to be making a generate it will automatically generate for a poster for your reference and these all are absolutely freely you can use it see this is a 10% offer discount and uh, go back and uh, see the information how it is uh, making for useful for you and also given straight away from here like uh, make it public to publish or save for a local like uh, if you want to make to save this document or picture to in your local computer you can download it and you can use it what is the name of the products if you specify clearly it will mention in the posters or cards so generating and wherever the requirements of social media marketing or uh, graphic designing yes try to practice with this dal e2 services of ai the ai making wonders and also you try like uh, see earlier i have uh, tried with the home like a promo so the promo with the shopping cart how it is generated and also like a graphic design of a house how it will be 3d arts it is created it's my existing uh, lectures and a graphic of uh, a horse with astronaut at uh, uh, like a horse riding at astronaut it is created by chat dalgi services only so why don't you try today and explore more options which are available in dali 2 and ensure to generate make more money wish you good luck thank you hello everyone welcome here in this section and this lecture you are going to learn like a best tools and extensions using chat gpt yes many of the tools are available in chat gpt and they are recently launching with the chat gpt support of uh, 
as you know that the products when you see like uh, for developers purpose like uh, api references they are giving and uh, examples they are giving and also see as a plugins as a plugins also like uh, their research plugins are also introducing for the new users now very interesting component i am get like uh, getting here to integrating chat gpt with google search yes integrating chat gpt services to our google search is it possible it's a super easy so let's begin with your like a uh, google chrome web browser and here in the right side three dots are there like a menu when you click here more tools are there under the more tools you just find extensions so these extensions when you click here these extensions when you click here in the left frame the three dots are here you just click on the menu so here open chrome web store click on the below see open chrome web store click on the below here where you can find the chrome store to get the extensions which are available just hit in a keyword chat gpt hit in a keyword chat gpt yes for google only let's see yes chat gpt for google just click here and add to chrome click here and add to chrome add extension yeah so it's a getting download and it's automatically installed in your computer system wow it's i think it's done so let's open a new window just simply on google search like uh, write a calculator program in python in c or java wherever you want you just click on the search item so here you are written some your query it's, it's a result set it's came for you to identify the links in the right side you may find chat gpt what the extension we are added for our google chrome search browser so along with the search it is a generating chat gpt how it is a calculator program is generated for our real chat gpt what we have seen in the lectures here it's a like see and the break all the python program it is generated here and chat gpt get the chat gpt to x faster and free if you want you can go for expand uh, like a uh, make sure to go for next steps and how the extensions you are going to be adding you have to be aware of it got it it's a free and uh, there is a no price then i have added and presenting you and uh, this particular education purpose only if you need and if you are interested along with your search you need such a chat gpt plugin or extension to be added to your browser then only you take a necessary step and add this will automatically saves your lot of time and uh, which query you are uh, finding here automatically chat gpt is also the same query will taken and it will give you an answer now just i am asking chat gpt to one, one more question uh, create a resume for fresher just simply i am asking google it's a given some links for google for me sponsored something 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 and here it will like a chat gpt yes here it is a chat gpt is a preparing resume for me so hopefully a query either google or chat gpt you just find at a single time if you feel really this uh, extension is a uh, helping and uh, like a saving more time if you feel then you go and add for this extension i'll show you one more time this step by step process how to add this extension so let's come to the browser and here in the right side three dots more tools and extensions these step by step you can make sure to pause the video and write down click on extensions in the left side three menu items it is there main menu click here in the bottom open chrome web store so the open chrome web store here you just type chat gpt chat gpt hit a keyword then it will filter yes first option it is chat gpt for google just click here automatically it will download it and install and accept the privacy report it will add it to your google web like a google chrome web browser so why don't you try today and have an a great experience of uh, learning chat gpt master classes i hope you will enjoy this sessions a lot 
to making you master in all the areas wherever you are making especially in focus thank you